Hi everyone, welcome back to Total Coins. In this video, we're going to carry on with our pre decimal coin hunt. We've still got our tub here, sort of full of pre decimal coins that we're going to look through. Um, and what I've also managed to do is sort out the coins from the last few videos so we can see how we're getting on. So we've got a couple of half pennies of the, the earlier years. So that one's up to up to 1911 and then these are all the ones from sort of the teens right the way through to the new ones which were brought out in the 1970s. We've got a really good collection of the one pennies going. So we've got every year from 1986, uh, sorry 1896 all the way through to 1912. So hopefully we can find the 1913 and fill this page as well. Oh no, sorry, what ones are we missing? So sorry, 1903, we're missing 1904, 1905. Uh, we've got quite a few we're missing on that page. A couple there. a few on that page and then we've got to take it right away up to 1967 so we've got our three pence here so we've not found a lot of them but hopefully we can find a few more we've got our six pence only two of them so far And then these are sort of some of the random ones that we've got. So we've obviously got the 1862 penny, the jersey, uh, what is it, one shilling? No, one twelfth of a shilling, sorry. A couple of farthings and a couple of old, like obviously that one's not going to go into the collection. And then the 1819, 1819. So what I'll do is, is every video I'll sort of make sure that this is kept up to date and we'll show you the progress at the beginning of each video. But with that said, let's carry on and see what we can find in this hunt. So there's our first one and that's uh, George V. It's a one penny from 1917. There's our first 1967 one penny. So that's got Elizabeth II on it. So this is the one that we tend to find sort of most often. I think it's something like over 600 million were minted. And there we go, another Elizabeth II. And another 1967. got a 1964 one penny and that's Elizabeth II as well so we've got so it's a farthing from let's have a look Nineteen twenty. That's George the Fifth. Yep. So as you can see down the bottom there, it's nineteen twenty. Quite beat up, but still a nice find, nevertheless. And 
we've got a three pence. 1962. And that's Elizabeth II. Another Elizabeth II. second. Uh, this time it's our first half pen to the hunt. And that is 1965. And there we go, we've got an Edward the Seventh. One penny. From 1907. Here, as you look at the dots around the outside, like how much detail it still has, even though sort of like some of it's worn down, it's got still so much detail on it. It's absolutely brilliant. So I don't think this is going to be a three decimal. No, it's an old 5p. Or new pence five. A new five pence, sorry. But nice find nevertheless. And what have we got? We've got a George the Sixth. 1939 farthing. That's the first time we've had one with that design on it. That's really nice. Yeah, I like that one. And another Elizabeth for second. Another half pence. From 1965 again. And there we go, we've got a George V. One penny from 1935. So you look at the amount of detail that that's still got on it. It's absolutely brilliant. Sixty-two, so that'd be Elizabeth for second. Brilliant. And there we go, another George the Fifth. Nineteen sixteen. Really worn down though. See any of the writing on it. It's a shame, but nevertheless, a nice find nonetheless. And there we go, we've got an Elizabeth for second. It's going to be 67. Yep. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, that's Victoria, but obviously with that whopping great hole in it, it's not overly collectible, <laughs> which is a real shame. Elizabeth II, and that's a 
sixpence from 1966. Brilliant. I'm not sure what years we've got in sixpence, but a couple more to add to the collection are always good. And there's, oh, what's happened to the top there? Uh, it's Elizabeth II, 1962, one penny. But it looks like someone's decided to put a hole through the top to make it into a key ring. Which is a shame. Oh, well, we're having the uh, the pick today with the uh, the damaged coins, aren't we? And there we go. We've got one that's intact. <laughs> so that's George the Sixth, half penny from 1947. George, another George V, 1914, one penny, which is in really good condition for its age. And you compare it to the, the 1916 that we had, and that's in amazing condition. George the fifth and another farthing. And this one is from 1917. Once again, condition's really nice on that. A lot better than the one that we found earlier. So definitely a nice find. Yeah, we've got another three pence. So that's Elizabeth for second. And that's 1959. So what I will do is obviously I'll put all the information for the coin up in the top corner. Um, and I'll also mark whether it's a new uh, a new year or not. There's another George V, and it's a half penny this time from 1917. Brilliant. And yet another George V. One penny from 1927. And that's Elizabeth II. And that's one shilling. So that's uh, that's the first one of them we've had. 1955. Uh, that's definitely a new coin. Brilliant. Wasn't expecting to have anything new. And another Elizabeth II. And another 1967 one penny. Seventh, a bit beaten up on the front here, but it's one penny from 1906. So I think that's one that we had, didn't we? I think mean, it was 05, 04 and 05 we were looking for. And 
another Elizabeth II, one penny from 1962. So it's the same year as the other one that we found that was damaged. I'm not sure if that's a, a new year or not. As I say, I'll put up in the descriptions if it is. And there's a 1967 half penny. That'll be Elizabeth II as well. Another George V. Now we have one penny from 1921. And a George VI this time. That's a half penny from 1941. Brilliant. Always look forward to the end of the video so I can actually see what ones are new, what ones are sort of new coins. And there we go, we've got slightly beaten up. 1941, three pence. George the sixth. Brilliant. And there we go, we've got another farthing. Uh, what year have we got? Nineteen fifteen. George the Fifth. So I think they've all been George the Fifth, haven't they? Apart from the one with the uh, the de different design. Wow. So what's that? That's Edward the Seventh. One penny from 1903. Yeah, 1903. So I think luckily we've got one of them already. And there we go, we've got a George the Sixth. It's gonna be a half penny from 1948. There we go, we've got another farthing with the bird on it. And that's from 1941. And that's George VI. And we've got another Edward VII. And Elizabeth II, a half penny from nineteen fifty five. A couple more. So, another Elizabeth for second half penny from 1967. So I think we've already got one of them in that in this hunt as well. And we've definitely got one in the book. And a 
1967 penny. That's uh, Elizabeth II. Uh, we've had quite a few of these in every video that we've done, unfortunately. And there's George V. One penny from 1927. Might have had have we had twenty seven in this hunt? Right, so I'll do two more. So that's Elizabeth the second. It's gonna be a half penny from nineteen fifty five again. Do one more as long as it's not a 1967 of anything. Uh, Elizabeth II, 1966, so <laughs> one year out, but still quite common. So, I tell you what, I want to do one more. <laughs> There we go, George V, one penny from 1920. Brilliant, not a really nice one to finish on. So, Star Pool. Probably say, have to be the, uh, the shilling, just because it's the uh, first one that we've had. So, yeah, always nice to add a a new coin to the collection so yeah so that's the end of this hunt so if you like the video please like subscribe so sort of click the bell icon to be kept up to date when I upload new videos uh, you can also follow me on Facebook Twitter and Instagram now the links will be in the description below um, so thanks for watching the video sort of I hope you're enjoying the pre decimal hunts um, finding sort of all the new coins or old coins but new for the collection um, but as I say sort of leave a comment down below let me know what you're thinking of the video and with that said I'll see you on the next one all right bye